Welcome back, Wowsery. This time I thought I'd do a uh, another Ultimate Admiral Dreadnoughts. No, we're in Alpha 10 here. Uh, do another custom battle. No, do a, kind of a post World War II Japanese battleship, a uh, battle cruiser. No, design it. I've got this hull right here. So let's see what we can do here. I'm going to go with a smaller tower. See if this works here. Put that one right there. Oh, it won't let me put one back there. Well, that kind of terrible. And let's see what type of guns do we have. At this rate, they would probably be at least 16. And I'm going to try twins. And shoot, it just is going to be like that, huh? I'll try it right there. Did I finally get enough room? Uh, I'm going to have to use the shift, the control key. There we go. Put one right there in the middle. A funnel. A nice tall funnel. Oh, 26%. That didn't change it. 31. 79. Well, I have to go with that. I want to try to get at least 90%. There we go. So I'll go with that. I'll give it a short range. Some barbettes. Get my secondary guns here. That's got a very uh, tiger, no, lion. Uh, Lion class battle cruiser look. Yeah, I may just have to do that and go screw it. Give myself some torpedo protection. Battle cruisers aren't known for their massive amount of protection schemes. I do want heavy TNT that brought it back down. This will bring it back on up. Range finder. And I got a little bit of weight left to play with some armor here. Bring it up to seven. Two inches, nine, and I'll put the rest into this belt. Nope, too much, too much, too much, too much. Okay, now that's where it'll stay. Uh, I didn't get anything right there. Darn it. Uh, three. Okay. I'll go with this right here. Now this ship right here. I go, uh, and they're calling it the, that's a, it's a heavy cruiser name right there. Don't know how this will 
handle this will work really wanted five turrets now two the Q and two and but uh, didn't quite work out oi that's a long hood type thing and what do we have so I really wanted to put a barbette back here like that but it just wouldn't let me it looked bow heavy doesn't it okay I can't really say I've heard of that name the Uji something like that let's uh Oh, you know what I forgot to do for balance? I could have put a torpedo back there. That's what I was going to do. Darn it. Completely forgot. Oh, well. Minus four for hull stability and tower. Huh, I like that. Minus 3.5% for morning time. Because everybody's still asleep, I guess. Man, AI has me going away from everything. Sheesh. It's always f these distant battles, and I, I, I just have a. I find those so boring. No, when you get so far away. The, the chant, the hit probability goes down. And it's just this long, drawn out battle. Now oh, they got 15 inch guns. And I'm on fire. Let's see. Make a harder turn here. This one should have pretty good, pretty good uh, arc of fire, right there. I'll do one round every one point one point two nine rounds a minute. Ah, there's a hit. It looks like the other, this one got it. Now yeah, we're locked in, so. Forty-seven percent, forty percent identification. Yeah, whenever I say that identification, I always think of think of Spaceballs hand print identification, please. Are they trying to <coughs> find the self-destruct? Uh, ammo detonation. Well, that just was a complete failure. Not going to be my bad. Oh, whoa. Two and three. This is not going to be a good battle. Are they identified yet? Nope. Are they going to sink me both before I'm identifi identified them? Oh, that's going to be terrible. I'm slowing down. I'm flooding. Probably get another ammo detonation or something on me. Man, I'm just really. Oh, there's another hit. Mid belt penetration. Man, 
And I sure didn't do much against them. Thought I had okay uh, long range fire, but obviously not. Not a good arc of fire for that turret. There we go. At least I got some damage on him. Ninety-three percent. Ah, dang. Seven. Man, he's just whooping my butt. There we go, 100%. Bring it back on down. Thunderer, 15 inch guns. They actually have a lower rate of fire than me. One 8 inch gun. And a bunch of 2 inch. Mm, standard. Barbet 4. He also probably had more tonnage to work. You know, 46,000 tons versus 33,000. So he had an additional 13,000 tons to do things with. I was at a disadvantage to begin with. Really not going to be doing much here. Let's see how long it takes me. There's another one flooding. Man, all three of my engines are out. Maybe I'll get another lucky hit. Nope. Yeah. Let's see. He's locked in 3.3, 3.8, and I'm 3.8. Nope, missed me again, suckers. I'll give a turn here and maybe that'll throw their aim off. Probably throw my aim off too. It'd be nice if I get a flash fire on him or one of them. Well, the 16 inch guns could do that. Ah, uh, there's another flooding. That'll knock me back down again. just kicked my butt on that one. As a battle cruiser design, I didn't think it was that bad. But when you lose one ship quickly, to like ammo detonation or something like that, it just wrecks havoc. Of course, battle cruisers don't have the heavy armor that a uh, battleship would, so I went traditional, tried to go for speed, over armor, and didn't work. Let me know what you think. Liked it, didn't like it, and I'll see you next video.